Hello everyone, myself Chandrasekhar welcoming you all to this another wonderful session. So guys, as you all know, the much awaited ISRO examination date have been announced recently for 17th of December 2023 and it is one of the golden opportunity for all the mechanical engineering aspirants because only for mechanical branch there are 163 posts and ISRO being one of the prestigious organization it is great to be part of this Indian Space Research Organization. So we are having around 20 to 22 days for this examination. So in today's session, I will be highlighting those areas, those points which you should avoid during your 20 to 22 days of preparation. What are the things you should not do to keep your preparation up to the level to score better and to get selection in Indian research space research organization. So let us start with number one. Do not skip even a single topic or a single chapter during your preparation for ISRO. Because there might be a possibility, a simple question can be asked from the topic you are skipping. At least revise once all the topics, all the chapters, the entire syllabus completely and thoroughly. If you have not completed your syllabus, please try to uh, study at least once those subjects, those topics which you have not covered so far. The number two. Again, very important part is do not skip the numerical practice and that too without using the calculator. Try avoiding, avoid using the calculator as much as possible. Try to improve your on your speed, your accuracy as well as uh, as well as your calculation part. So revision of the subject and practicing the numericals you cannot skip for better and efficient preparation. The next important thing is after appearing for the test, mock test, test series or if you even if you are practicing the questions whenever you are committing any mistake try to learn from your mistakes. Try to uh, try to implement or try to improve the weak areas so that you can get the understanding only after your self evaluation after appearing for the test after, after practicing the questions. So learning cannot be done without errors and mistakes. So whatever the mistakes you are committing you should learn from those mistakes and you should not repeat those mistakes in your actual final examination. The next important part is do not compare your performance with others because every single individual and every single aspirant is unique. You don't know what is their preparation journey, what are the challenges they are facing, what are the difficulties, what are the positive things they are having, advantages they are having. So you cannot compare yourself with others rather you should compare your today's performance with your yesterday's performance. So keep on improving yourself day by day and keep your momentum, keep your preparation continuous without any discontinuity that is how you will be having a better edge over others. The next important thing is do not think that your preparation is all over. There is always a scope for improvement. So keep your preparation continuous. Do not waste a single minute for the next 20 to 22 days. Do not uh, waste your time indulging in social media. 
and indulging yourself in unnecessary arguments or otherwise because every single moment is very crucial so keep a daily routine make it routine and try to follow your routine for the next 20 days without fail without any discontinuity so when you will keep yourself busy throughout the day then you will not find any time for negativity to enter in your mind and the 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 notions which disturb your mind which disturb your preparation so try to avoid yourself from those negative things from those demotivations as much as possible and keep yourself self motivated and one of the important aspect in any preparation is do not ever give up even if you are feeling some uh, somewhere low even if you are feeling demotivated keep yourself positive try to practice try to revise do not think about the results because every single moment is crucial and uh, the fighting spirit throughout your entire journey of preparation plays a very very important role in getting your selection in the examination and last but not the least do not ever stop keep studying day and night try to utilize your time to the fullest until you get the selection until you get yourself satisfied with your preparation so these are the important areas you should keep in mind and working hard there is no substitute to hard work when you are ready to do the hard work with your full enthusiasm with your full zeal and with your full passion then nobody can stop you from getting the success in examination as well as in your life so that is all from my side for the session i hope you will implement these areas in your day to day routine and believe me you will see the miracle in the coming days thank you have a good day and a great career ahead jai hind